What's going on, Muscle Monsters? Align Gonzalez here, and today this is going to be a quick video, but I'm going to give you a few action steps that you can take right now in order to start off your muscle building journey. Again, that's not tomorrow or next week, it's right now. All right, so the first thing I want you to do is figure out realistically how many days and even hours during those days you can dedicate to training in the gym, all right? Because it doesn't matter uh, what program you want to follow, it's about the program that you can follow, all right? So if you have only three days that you can dedicate to going to the gym, then a program that consists of five days is not going to work for you, all right? So that's the first step. The next thing you wanna do is now that you know that, pick a program. There's no reason for you to want to create your own program when people have already created it for you and they're proven, right? We're talking about experts who have the knowledge, the experience that you don't have and they've already put it out for you to follow, okay? You don't have to reinvent the wheel. Just find a program and stick to it. And what I'm gonna do to make this even easier for you is I'm going to link a bunch of free programs that you can start with down below, all right? And then lastly, you need to figure out how much you should be consuming. And I'm gonna give you a very simple breakdown, all right? I don't want you to overthink it, all right? Your goal is to build muscle. You need one gram per pound of body weight and protein. So if you weigh 120 pounds, then you need 120 grams of protein per day, right? Now most people, or some people rather, would say that you don't need that much. But it's a good starting point, and I say that because if you fall short, you're still getting enough. And if you aim for lower and fall short, then you're not. All right, so one gram per pound of body weight is pretty much the overall consensus, and it's a great place to start. As far as fats go, 0.3 to 0.4 times your body weight. All right, that's how many fats you need on a daily basis in order to get all the health benefits of a healthy fat intake. All right, then in terms of carbs, I would multiply my weight by maybe 1.5 to 2 or a number uh, between those and start there. It doesn't matter if it's perfect. Don't overthink it. Pick the number, make the calculation, and start hitting those calories. Um, so here's what you're going to do. All right, and this is kind of just uh, something that you can come back and watch later, right? You've already, you already know how many days you're going to be training. You've already picked your program. You know how much you're going to be eating. But just to ensure that you continue growing and just to ensure that you are eating enough, right? Because the numbers I gave you are just a starting point. But to ensure that you're eating enough, here's what I want you to do. I want you to weigh yourself every single morning on an empty stomach. At the end of the week, get an average of all your weigh-ins. Do that for a second week. Now, I want you to match your previous week to this week and see what the changes were, right? See if you gained weight. And if you did, that means that the calories you're consuming are putting you in a surplus and this is going to be enough to put size on you. Now, if it stayed the same, this is going to mean that you're at maintenance. So all you have to do is take that number that you got for your carbs and increase it by about 25 and that should be more than enough to now get you into that surplus. And I want you to continue tracking your weight and getting the averages so that when you do stall, all you have to do is make that quick adjustment, put you back in that slight surplus and get you putting on size again. So that's pretty much it guys. Figure out how much time you have to dedicate to the gym. Stop trying to come up with your own program. Just pick one. They're all proven and they all work great. And lastly, make sure you're eating enough. Use that very basic formula as a starting point. Track and adjust and you'll continue growing on demand. That's pretty much it, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, click the like button below. Subscribe for more videos. If you haven't already, make sure to grab Mass in a Flash. It's completely free. The link is down below. Go there. Put your name and your email address. You'll get instant access to that. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Peace.